This is not for the first time Manipur has seen the ethnic conflict. The Manipur has seen killing of civilian people, police people, army personnel. Since last, in a way, 75 years. And primarily, if you see the data, uh, these are data uh, particularly uh, available in various websites which you can uh, cross check. In year 1990, 300 people killed in the state of Manipur. Of course, that point of time, Congress government was in power. Subsequently, in the 1993, 1100 people were killed or died in the state of Manipur. In 1997, 400 people killed. In 2001, 95 people killed. 2003, 140 people killed. 2006, 105 people killed. 2008, 200 people killed, 2010, 220 people got killed, and 2012, 165 people got killed. I do not want to refer to the name of community. In out of this, there are many a times you will see that these are ethnic conflict, and many a times there are other kind of violent activities. And if you see that all this has happened during the Congress regime, I want to clearly state that because of the wrong policy adopted by Congress party during the forma formative years, today Northeastern state is not able to resolve various dispute that exists in our region from the time of we attaining the freedom. They have, cre they have created a situation. They have put provision in the constitution. They have created safeguard in the constitution, either which is creating various issues, various problem among the communities, Either or they have not done something which should have been done in very beginning to resolve the conflict. 